I'm second nature after a while. Thank you, Jason. Some local emergency responders are in Hawaii tonight. It's no vacation. They have a serious mission to help overextended crews in the vicinity of the Kilauea volcano that has spewed destructive lava for weeks now. And Tenny Your Sides' Kayla Gaskins is here to tell us what these crews from Gates County will be doing to help Kayla. And they have got a lot of work to do. North Carolina sent a team of 10 over to Hawaii, including Billy Wynn, the emergency management director for Gates County, who spoke to us from where the team is based just miles from flowing lava. They landed in Hawaii last Saturday and quickly got to work. It's a massive undertaking here that is still actually in the response phase. Billy Wynn and his team are based in Hilo, about 25 miles away from the volcanic activity. It's, it's a phenomenal sight to see. Uh, surreal is the only word that makes any sense to us. The team does a lot of logistical support, resource planning, managing evacuations, shelters, and road closures. It's a volcanic event, but it's not lava spewing from the top of a volcano like you see in the movie. Uh, the fissures are just opening up in the ground due to earthquakes, and the lava just comes from from the ground. On Sunday, they had a search and rescue mission to get a man trapped by lava to safety. Wynn says the people of Hawaii are extremely grateful and are handling this disaster as best as they possibly can. Those people have been phenomenal to deal with. They are resilient people. Wynn says this type of lava event isn't unusual for Hawaii. What is unusual is when they happen in populated areas like this. About as quick as you could walk is, is how fast the lava was was actually pushing forward and taking taking back that community. And for a guy from Gates County, North Carolina, these are sites he won't soon forget. It is surreal. There are many, many images online, and they do zero justice for the, the awesomeness of, of nature. Now, most of the images that we just showed you were sent to us from that North Carolina team. They are scheduled to be on the island for another week. Coming up at 6, how dealing with lava compares to dealing with hurricanes and other natural disasters these North Carolina teams are more familiar with. Also, why North Carolina and why someone from Gates County was sent to help in Hawaii? For now in the studio, Kayla Gaskins, 10 on your side.